boys welcome to a new drift compilation this mod i swear to god i saw it last drift compilation the same mod but it was a different clip there's a lady sitting on the left side there as well look at that map is oi warf i love it now that is a quality drifting clip here's a pretty cool clip as well there's fireworks in the background and we have a car i don't know what car that is but it's doing a 360 entry here and it has neons as well i think it's the same map by the way yeah, this is the same map once again, but during daytime, there is a silly S15. And this is what they call the grandpa spec, right? Doesn't look like it's a sporty car, but people use it for drifting. I mean, this car everyone knows, a BRZ or the 86. Nice little sports car. Nissan Silvia S15. And now we have third person view over here. A 360 entry once again in the Oiwarf in a setup. And this map is probably the one from Riga, right? And there is a crazy tandem going on here. Jesus! This is straight like from out of a movie or something. And the tandems don't stop here, boys. We have a three-man tandem in... What is the map? Drift Playground. There we go. A little drone cam is following them. Look at that. They're still side by side there. Oh, there's more people in the server. It's like a full-on drift server full of people. I like it. And this is the new Supra boys. You guys love your Supras. The map is, I believe, once again, Oi Warf. Yeah, another 360 entry here. I mean, you can never get tired of this map, right? Always looks good. But I'll be honest, I would prefer the old Supra to the new one. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Here is a Sil 80, ladies and gentlemen. Has a 180 back and Sylvia front. And another tandem in Drift Playground. Actually, two tandems dual tandem but these ain't the same dudes we saw earlier these are different dudes over here look at that okay now it's a three-man tandem wow jesus how many effects do you want yes all of them please what bro there is so many effects here uh there's a lot of rain reflections oh it's torx Talion. i just noticed torx Talion, the famous drift car Bro, my PC is even lagging watching this. My PC doesn't even have to render anything and it's already lagging. Oh, some first person view action here as well. You can't even see anything out the window. How can you drive like that? There is no visibility at all. But it is cool what you can do with mods in Assetto, right? Here is Assetto once again. A little heavy to jump there. Man, that landing was so hard. Very stiff suspension. Look at that, it goes nice and wide there. Oh, it has neons as well, I like it. Alright, I have no idea what car that is. Guys, if you know what car this is, let me know in the comments. Kinda lifted as well. Oh, this is CarX Drift Racing Online, boys. Kinda looks like a Cero, you know? But yeah, at the bottom right, there is like this speedometer there. Gives it away. Yeah, this is, again, the map from Riga, right? He's doing like a solo FT run over here. Very good map for competitive drifting. Goes very close to the barrier. Look at that. Perfect line. And Sylvia S13 once again. Popular car. And now some BMG action as well. There is a 3... Nope. That's a 720 at least. Man, if you played BMG, you gotta respect people who can drift in BMG, okay? It's not easy. Look at that. Another corner. Nice and clean there. I tried drifting with keyboard in BMG. It was way easier than with the steering wheel. I don't know what he's using, but he's throwing another 360. And this is a Supra, boys. There we go, the old Supra, yeah. I like the older one more. Just ripping it here in this mountain path. And Jesus, that is a bus. <laughs> Yo, that is a bus leading the tandem train over here. Jesus, okay, this has to be a mod. There is no way a bus is in the game. I didn't know you can mod your game and other people can see your mods in Forza. What is that? I've heard people modding the bus into the game, but I never thought other people would see the mod. That is very cool. Alright, yeah, Assetto Corsa with those crazy mods. We have a lawnmower here. Oh, it's a Honda lawnmower. Hey, it's a Civic, boys! I'm, so I'm sorry, I take it back. Very bad joke. Civics, very nice cars, okay. Honestly, drifts pretty good here, right? Okay, dude. Acero Corsa mods are going a little too far. What is that? It's a shoe. There is no way this is a car. This is a shoe. What? How do people come up with these ideas? Who woke up one morning and was like, I gotta make a mod that is a car but is a shoe? 
What? Yo, a lot of Aceroporza clips today. So we have a wheel cam today. A nice little reverse center over here. He has a Logitech G29 or G920. I don't know which it is. But yeah, wheel cam drift clips, very cool. Oh, he has a cinematic version of this reverse entry as well. Look at that. Very nice send. And this is an ABC jump, everyone knows that. An old RX7 here. I like the color. Another beautiful car, Sylvia S13. We have seen at least three Sylvia S13s today. A 360 entry here. I like it, it's a clean car. Oh, this car used to be a police car, right? In US. They use this as police cars. Look at how he's avoiding the pole there. Very close to the barrier there. And this is a reverse 360 entry. Clean. Some beam and G action over here as well. Look at that. Man, beam and G honestly looks pretty beautiful as well. Looks lovely. Oh, yes. Bro, this is the best looking Forza City ever. This is an older Forza Horizon version. Man, look at the city. I want this city in Forza Horizon 5. Man, city drifting clips are the best. Like, drifting with traffic in the city. And this is a perfect city as well. A little Miata with the spoiler here whipping it. Man, this is beautiful. A Lambo doing a little flip and landing on the ramp. And here is a very long sausage. It's a limo. Look at that. It's going very fast. 270 kilometers per hour. And he's sideways. Look at that. Why does the limo have a spoiler on? It looks really weird. Another Forza Horizon 4 tandem here. No bus this time. Apparently the bus went home. Bus got tired. Yeah, this is like the most popular section ever in Forza Horizon 4 for tandem, right? Too bad we don't have this area in Forza Horizon 5. We have a container area in Forza Horizon 5, but it's nothing like this. It's like 10 times smaller. Would be really cool if we had this exact area in Forza Horizon 5. But Tandem is looking clean. A 350Z and a Nissan Silvia S13, yeah. Another Silvia S13. Oh, there's one behind as well. And this is BMNG without any taillights. What? Okay, there we go. In first person view. Oh, he's trying to replicate the Tokyo Drift scene. You guys remember where the dude crashed into the barriers? <laughs> yeah, there we go. He has a bumper delete as well now very accurate and boys if you enjoyed this compilation make sure you subscribe for more drop that like and as always stay sideways